Hi, my name is Marcy Borders. I'm from Bayou, New Jersey. Um, I became famous from working in the North Tower on the 81st floor. My image is known all over the world as the Dust Queen. The morning of 9-11, my supervisor had thought maybe, you know, a small jet plane might have nipped us, but at that time we had no idea what was going on. Um, so then I began to panic, you know, so they, you know, sat me down, told me to, you know, relax, take deep breaths. But um, the way the building was shaking, it was just, I, I couldn't sit there. You felt the building shaking and you heard the explosion, you heard the rumble, you heard everyone. You actually saw um, chairs coming out the windows, office supplies, and to what I know now, people, because um, that day I was like, um, oh my goodness, this can't be people. Like, I just thought it was something with me, but then I realized uh, now that it was, uh, other workers, and um, it was a uh, rough way down. These packed with millions of people trying to get on. There I saw, you know, you just heard people screaming, stay away from the glass, stay away from the glass. You saw um, injured, I saw people with objects in them, uh, burnt skulls, it was, it was crazy compared to what I just left. My stairwell was normal. That's when you just hear firemen scream and run and don't look back. Then I took chase, you know, from this cloud of dust, smoke that's just following me. And uh, once it caught me, it like threw me on, you know, my hands and my knees, you know, every time I inhaled, my mouth just filled up with it. I was choking. I couldn't see my hand in front of my face. I was just like, you know, saying to myself and saying out loud that I didn't want to die. I didn't want to die. And a stranger, he, I, I remember clear as day, he, he didn't have a shirt on. And um, he, he grabbed me and, you know, with so much going on, I was kind of afraid of him. So I was asking him, um, what are you gonna do? Where are you taking me? What are you gonna do? And um, he was like, to safety. I guess that's where this picture was taken. And um, I'm known all over as the dust lady.